Crush FTP supports advanced file management right from a web browser. I'm going to show you some examples of that. I'm going to log in as an end user. I have a few files here, and I want to move this into the counting folder. I can just take it and drag and drop it into the counting folder. And we can look in the counting folder, and we see our file in there. You can also drag and drop to the OS, such as your desktop or a folder. On OS X, you use the command key as you drag, and on Windows, you use the control key. So I'm going to take this item here and drag it to my OS. And the file has been downloaded. There's also many other customizations you can do. You can right click and rename in place. You can right click, copy and paste. as well as use the buttons on the button bar. Since the items that we have in this folder have had thumbnails generated on them, we can also right click and preview them. There's live filtering and directory listings. So in large listings, you can search easily for a few items that might contain a specific extension or word in their name. I'm going to search on SSL, and it filters live as I type. There's also the ability to search. So you can search from the current folder that you're in in all sub items. So I can click on search, and I'm going to search for limited. And it found an item in the accounting folder called limited admin roles. Searching can also search based on keywords. So I can right click on a file and attach some specific keywords to it. I've assigned two keywords on this file, house and garage. And if I search on that, I'll be able to find that file based on those keywords. And here's my file that has those keywords attached to it. Or you can also switch the thumbnail view that will show you larger thumbnails on the different icons. And as you hover your mouse over, you'll see a bigger version of it as well. It has a slider so you can increase the size of the thumbnails. This can be especially useful when you're viewing lots of image files. There's also a download basket that you can use to collect files that you want to download that may not all be in the same location. So I'm going to right click on this item and add it to the basket. I'm not ready to start downloading yet so I'm just going to close the basket. I'm going to go in another folder right click, add to basket, and again grab one more file, right click, add to basket. Now with one click I can download all the files that are in my basket. There's also previews on the items that are in your basket in case you wanted to go back and remove a couple. I'm going to remove this one here and now download it. Those are just some of the advanced file management activities that you can do in the web interface of Crush FTP.